Tech. In this video, I am going to show you a teardown of a wall plug-in power supply, and I'm going to show you how to salvage the components that are inside. Let's get started. As you can see, this is a 12 volt, 1.5 amp power supply. The components in this is going to be really interesting. So I have here my trusty pocket knife again, and I'm going to go and find a way to pry this open. And there we go. Now it's pried open. Ah, look at these components. They look very nice, very clean and healthy. Everything looks like it's gonna function well because this plug, however, is fairly new. So of course, everything in there is gonna be functioning correctly. So let's get desoldering. And here are the components. Also, I got some wire too, which is also very useful. Right here, this is a 50 volt 10 microfarad capacitor, a 25 volt 1000 microfarad capacitor, can be very useful, two 400 volt 15 microfarad capacitor, and I have a teroid coil that can be very useful for step down or step up power supplies to use in the future and that can be very useful in future projects. And right here, a 12 volt 1.5 amp transformer, that too can be useful for future projects. I have right here a 2 amp fuse which can handle 250 volts, a 1021 k volt ceramic capacitor, and I can't really identify this ceramic capacitor. The writing isn't very clear, but I'll look, test it later. And right here, a basic diode, very useful for future projects for a full bridge rectifier, possibly. And finally, the last component, an HFP4N65 in channel MFET or EM. FET, a very useful component. I could be using that for future projects in the future. So there you have it. All of the components that I have salvaged from this power supply. Thank you for watching SciTi Tech. Till the next tech. Goodbye.